there are some people that aren't car people per se where it's just an appliance that gets them from A to B. Then there are people who, like myself, it's my life. I have my other passions, but first and foremost, it's cars. My dad used to race Porsche Classic Cup back in the UK. I grew up in you know, the back seats of Porsche 911s from, from an early age, and I've always loved them, and I've always lusted after one. I've owned all sorts of different cars and they all have their benefits, but there's no car I've owned like an early 911. And I love the looks, I love the lines, I love the feeling, I love everything about it. So yeah, when I park it, I look back at it and I love it every time. And it makes me excited in the morning to get up and know that's the one parked in my garage and that's what I'm gonna to drive today. My name's Lawrence Fitzsimon, and I drive a 1978 Porsche 911 SC. It's the second iteration of the G-bodied car. They came out in 1978, so it's the first of the wider-bodied cars after the narrow-bodied 74 through 77 cars. very smooth. There's something amazing about that air called sound. You know, there are the rattles that scare you. There are the noises here and there, but there's something very smooth, very sort of warming when you hear it when you drive it. And something very exciting when you get it up into the top end. I think the imperfections are what make my car unique. When I bought it, it was black over brown. Factory, it was copper brown, metallic over brown, which is why I really wanted the car. And picking up pieces here and there and trying to right the wrongs, it sort of morphed into something that I really love and I really sort of always wanted. There's this progression with the car where eventually it'll end up back in its original state, but it has this modular state in between where it's special and there's something fun and it's, it's very unique in its own right. Getting in it every morning, turning the key, and driving it. When I have other cars to drive, it's the only one I want to touch. Whether it's driving up the street, or whether it's going 400 miles to see my parents, it's always fun. There's always a, something amazing about the sensation of driving that 911. And there's something about the comfort. It always brings a smile to my face. That's the most rewarding part about that car. And people love it. There's no car I've ever owned where it, you get more of people that love it, people that look at it, people that compliment it, people that photograph it. And there's something special about it. And it's not the most special one out there, but the lines, there's something about it that people adore. There is something to be said about the whole Porsche world. I actually went with a friend who bought a 930 Turbo. We became friends through that, and we go along to Porsche events, and it's funny, he pointed out, when you go there, you want every single one. No matter that most of them are the same model, you want every single one because they're all special, and there's something about that with a 911 where most other cars, you can go and buy one, and they're all exactly the same, but with a 911, each one has a different soul, each one has a different story, and there's something very special about it, and it makes you want every single one, no matter its quirks, no matter its benefits. They're all special in their own right.